Um, the main important thing, ladies and gentlemen, is we have to have this as a squared minus b squared. So therefore, what I want to do is say, is this written as a squared minus b squared? Can I write this as a term squared? So what I need to do is determine, is 64 a square number? Yeah. Can I write it as 64? Yes. I can write it as 8 squared. M, I can obviously write as m squared, as it already is written as m squared. Is this a square? Can I write this as a square number? Yeah, this is going to be 3 squared y squared. So when you have both your terms, both raised to the same power, we can write them as 8m squared minus 3y squared. Do you now see how it's a term squared minus another term squared? Right? Where you could actually say A equals 8m and B equals 3y. Right? Here it is going to replace it for this form. Now, oh, this equals 0, right? Or no, just to say simplify, right? Uh, yeah, it just says factor it. All right, so now the main important thing is once you can understand this, we just need to remember how to use how do you factor difference in two squares? A minus B times A plus B. So now, if you already know what A is, and you already know what B is, you just plug them into that format. You guys remember when I talked, what I told you guys before when I made this video? Because if I can hear it, it means everybody. 